Hi, I'm Sarab Kamu. I am 5'7". I am reading for the role of Julia the Elder, and I am with Productions Plus Talent Shop. Your father is trying to consolidate power, which of course means strengthening ties to his top generals. Hasn't he already brought peace to the land? He wants you to marry Tiberius. Tiberius is married. Well, of course there'll be a divorce. I am still grieving my late husband's passing. And Tiberius's mother is already his wife, my stepmother. What other ties does he need? You know how much your father cares about the importance of family. I am happy here. I have my family. I'm afraid your father's decision for the law of the land. He wants to make Tiberius his heir? This isn't a monarchy! What about the restoration of the Republic? I think it would be best to do as your father says. <gasps> oh, oh my goodness, it's my father's podium. <laughs> be careful, we might ask you to preside instead. Oh, Senex, my darling Senex, how are you? As good as ever, my dear. Oh, my darling Senex, I miss you. I never see you at the Capitoline building anymore where all you senators supposedly work. You might not miss me as much if they restored the actual powers of the Roman Republic. Oh, Senex, you were always my favorite. Maybe I can help. Please do. <laughs> I never thought I'd see you wielding your father's gavel. Oh, well, you know how much blood ties and family values mean to us. citizens of Rome, in honor of the 15th year of the restoration of the Roman Republic, under no democratic vote at all, we have appointed our Emperor Caesar Augustus's daughter Julia to take over at his almighty podium to see how she, through the barter of sexual favors, might fix the current political situation. Now, first on the docket, world hunger. It has been brought to my attention that in the developing world, while most of us in the upper classes have plenty to eat, there are others who are out of work and at times starving. My solution? Felicio. <laughs> That's right. One lucky man or woman, as the case may be, cunnilingus, who can solve this naughty problem of inequity institutionalized through our governing order will receive, yes, a blowjob from yours truly. Oh, oh, and mind you, this isn't any ordinary spit. Oh, no, no, no. This spit that will alight on your dong is royal saliva. Mm. Passed down from the bloodline of the divine emperor himself. Okay, next on the list, the true restoration of the Roman Republic. Now, it has been brought to my attention through my position as royal baby maker and diaper changer that while supposedly we have a representative government called the Senate, this Representative government has no actual power. And furthermore, the senators seem to have nothing better to do than to hang out with this divine baby maker. Since there's no other senatorial work to be done. So, to solve that problem, I offer... I offer you the whole package.